Hey everybody, it is Aaron at Warmoth, and today we are doing a swimming pool shootout. So come on in, the water is fine. <laughs> Now, as you may already know, Warmoth offers a bunch of options on our top-routed Stratocaster replacement bodies. Uh, we offer um, single, 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 hum, hum, single, hum, single, single, reverse, single, and universal, uh, otherwise known as swimming pool route. And the obvious advantage of a swimming pool route is that you can put any combination of pickups in it that you want without having to do additional routing. You know, if you get single, 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 you're pretty much anchored to that. But with a universal, as long as you can find a pickup pick guard that will hold them, you can put any com combination of pickups in there that you want. Now the question is, does that uh, convenience come with drawbacks as far as tone? And that's what we're going to find out today. Um, we're going to compare a Stratocaster replacement body that's routed single, 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 uh, as this one currently is, to one that is routed universal, as this one soon will be, and see if we can hear a difference. Now, some people will say maybe one is better or worse than the other. Others will say um, they may be different. Uh, whether it's better or worse is a matter of your perception. And... Um, or there may be no perceptible difference at all. And that's what we aim to find out today. Now, I'm withholding judgment, um, but I will say that there are at least a few high-end uh, guitar builders who use a universal route as the standard route. Uh, for example, uh, every, every Dongrosh that I've ever seen with the top popped off of it is universally routed. So there are at least some high-end builders who... who um, who don't feel that a uh, swimming pool route is any kind of a disadvantage. And to do this test, I'm going to be using this body of tonal discovery. Um, and uh, you'll just have to take my word for it at the moment, but it's routed single, single, single. Maybe after I disassemble it, uh, after I do the test and then disassemble it, then I'll show it to you just to verify that it's single, 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 but it is. Um, and uh, of course, that'll be once I'm done with the first round of uh, clips, I'll send it to be uh, routed universal, and then I'll bring it back and put everything back together and do a second round of clips. Aside from the body, everything is going to stay the same. Same neck, tuners, uh, all everything on the pit guard, all the electronics, the jack, everything will stay the same. Nothing will change. Um, this all comes off as a unit, so I don't have to worry about pickup heights changing, but I will double check just to make sure the distance to the strings stays exactly the same. Now, as far as the sounds for this video, these are Seymour Duncan SSL-1 calibrated set. I'm gonna be going into my EVH-5150, uh, just using the green and the blue channels with all controls at noon. Then I'll be going into the uh, two notes, uh, Captor X, and then into my DAW. Um, so everything will stay perfectly consistent through both tests, and we'll see what we get.
Okay, well, I have uh, listened to the clips back. I've listened to them on speakers and in headphones and really analyzed them. And I'm fairly convinced that I've just gone to a lot of trouble to prove that uh, the, the shape of the route doesn't make a whole lot of difference. I can't hear any difference between those clips, other than the fact that in a couple of them, I play it a little differently, but sound-wise, I don't hear any difference at all. Um, so if you do, let me know what you hear in the comments. I'm curious to hear what you think. Um, so I guess that's a wrap. But before I go, uh, here is a picture of this body when it was routed for single, single, single. And then here's a clip of me um, putting it back together once it was routed universal, just so you know that I'm not messing with you. And one other thing about this body, uh, it has a hip shot hardtail bridge on it. Uh, we, for a long time, we offered the hip shot hardtail bridge route as a, an off menu option that you could get if you called in. But now we are offering that route as a standard menu option. And we're also offering the bridge now in um, chrome, black, and gold. Um, and I'm pretty excited about that because this is one of my favorite hardtail bridges. And they, those are both available on the website right now. So if you want to know more about the bridge route or the bridge or swimming pool routes or anything else warmth related, go to the website or give our customer service reps a call. And until next time, keep on picking.